Well, canine officers with the Hennepin County Sheriff's Office now have new protective vests. That's a big deal when you consider 60% of police dog deaths are caused by gunshot, stabbing, or blunt trauma injuries. Sonia Goins has more on the essential equipment. Comes home with me and we live together and, you know, and, uh, you know, we come to work together every day. Deputy Tyson Donnelly and his canine partner, Smokey, have been together for two years. Stay. Smokey is one of eight four-legged officers recently outfitted with a ballistic vest. Come on. Putting the device on is easier said than done. Just like with anything new, the dog is going to be a little, a little weirded out by it. The canine vest will take some getting used to. They're heavier than the ones human officers wear. They're also stab-proof, or stab-resistant also, so they're going to be a little heavier than just a regular uh, vest for us. But Deputy Donnelly says the equipment is needed. He says Smokey puts his life on the line every day. We come across a lot of situations uh, where we're looking for people that are armed, and it's always nice to have that extra protection for the dog when he's searching for a dangerous suspect. Donnelly says he has peace of mind knowing Smokey is protected. Oh, well, it's great. Less likely chance that he'll get hurt. In Brooklyn Park, Sonia Goins, 12 News. A Massachusetts company donated the eight vests. Each one costs about $950.